Hi, my name is Yo, and uh, you're watching the AU Review at Canadian Music Week. So, uh, m musically, let us in on what's happening at the moment. Well, we have just released our second single from the EP, and the um, it's doing well. We kind of got our first uh, internet feature based here in Toronto, I think, like last night, which is cool. Congratulations. Let's hope that brings a few people to the shows. Yeah, every, every little bit helps. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Uh, we're, we're hoping to make a... Uh, we're, try, we're hoping to put a video out soon for it as well and release the EP later. We've got a big Australian tour pretty much two weeks after we get home. Uh, so that's exciting as well, you know. We've got a lot in the pipeline. And where's that tour taking you? Um, where are we hitting? So we've, we start in Melbourne and then we have shows in Perth and we've also got Brisbane, Sunshine Coast, Adelaide, Canberra and Sydney, Armadale, Lismore, Byron Bay. It's all, uh, yeah, those are pretty much where we're playing. Those are the cities we're playing. Do you have a favourite place or maybe a vent or something like that to play? That maybe, maybe you've only played it once and you want to do it again? Or? We really like festivals. They're always fun. The last one we played was Kyneton Music Festival. That was just recently. Mm. Um, that was a really, it's a young festival, but it's good because they're open, you know, like they're, they're really encouraging. Um, we've really enjoyed going to Sydney as well, just recently. Mm. For a long time, for the first kind of five or six years I was doing music, Sydney was difficult. Mm. And now we've found a network there that is quite supportive. Mm. So whenever an opportunity comes up to go to Sydney, we get really excited now. So, yeah. Did you do Jurassic Lounge at some point? We did. We played at Jurassic Lounge back when I was doing kind of like country folk stuff. Um, and that went well. I mean, it was. I it was remember really that show. Yeah. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, it was a long time ago. <laughs> it was a little different. Yeah. Yeah, it was very different to what we do now. So, what what brought about that change? Do you think you know, from from what you were doing then to what you're doing now? I think that was a very the country stuff was a real cathartic choice mm. to exercise some demons that I'd picked up along the way after doing music and dealing with the industry for a little while, mm. uh, and then after that. Um, I just really wanted to, I guess, dance again and have a good time kind of getting up to beats and projecting that energy out instead of the whole hushed, quiet room, everyone listening to the lyrics type of thing. Mm. Um, and so, yeah, we, we, went, we went to that. We went that direction. So. Would you ever go back? Would you ever... Yeah, 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 yeah. I've actually been experimenting with some stuff in our shed at home and I kind of want to do another album that's much more folk-based. folk, folk based. Uh, Everyone always shakes their head when I talk about this. <laughs> well, but, I mean, is, is there any kind of a warrant now to maybe have two different project names or something that, like that? That is definitely an option, and I've been thinking about it. Um, it's stuff that you've got to, like, consider how much time you have, because to do anything properly, you need to focus on it, and you yeah. need the time to focus on it. So if I want to do a folk thing, I really have to stop doing the electronic thing for a little while at least yeah. to, to, to make room for it um, so it has to be a considered approach I think and now that you're tackling North America you know, is there anywhere else on, on the agenda for your worldwide domination we want to hit up uh, the UK for sure and there have been a few pockets of interest in Euro the rest of Europe as well where you know, we've got a, a big blog feature in France and there's like Portugal and Brazil are, are really like interesting. It's, that's cool, you know. I don't, yeah. I've never, I don't know anything about those places. <laughs> like, and um, it's, yeah, it's going to be fun. I, th I think in the next couple of years, we'll have some really cool opportunities come up and tackle us down. I think that's a good note to end it on. Thank you very much for your time and best of luck here in Toronto. No worries, Larry. Thank you.